Look my hubby beast. Uh, I, thought, I thought I accidentally blurred and me. I thought I blurred the camera because I sometimes when you tap the screen, it's, it focuses somewhere else. Um, but let me give it to the cameraman. Here you go. All right. Today is chest day, but today's topic is uh realness, I guess. So what I'm what do I mean by realness? Right. No. Yeah, I wake up every day sometimes. I mean, not, yeah, I wake up every day, obviously. Freaking, I'm still alive, right? Um, but whenever I go into the bathroom, you know, I'm brushing my teeth. I, I don't feel like, I don't like how I look. I don't like my voice. I don't like my laugh. You know, a lot of aspects I really don't like about myself. But the thing is, some things you kind of got to accept. Right, and just build on that from your personality. Other things you can do, and you know what that is, is change yourself. For example, I I didn't always have the physique I have now. Right, I um I worked for it. Right, I would go to the gym every day. I uh, work out really hard, very intense. I track my calories. I track my macros, and through all of that work, I was able to achieve something, and make something that I didn't like into something I I do like, you know, but I still have times where I look at myself and I feel like, damn, I'm, I look like absolute dog water, you know, and that's just how it's always going to be for humans. It's never enough, you know, um, and that comes with how, just how much more you realize there is, like, for example, when you're, when you're not in a certain aspect or tapping into a certain aspect of your life for example when i've gotten when i started right i wanted to be as big as some certain individual right but then once i've reached that right then i realize there are other people out there that are like so much bigger right and the thing is that's kind of the aspect you kind of look at whenever you go into anything there's always something bigger out there that you think you you were there but then you have to actually achieve something that's higher than that and it's like you know there's so many things that that go and play into factor right where um you have to achieve that certain level but it's hard it's very difficult right and every single time right I have like these ups and downs where I look at myself and I just don't look, look feel right, right? Where I hear my my voice, and I just hate it, right? You gotta you gotta realize there's just some certain aspects where in our life that we can't control, right? And we gotta accept it. But like, we gotta do everything in our power to kind of just everything in our power to kind of be better, right? Because if you're if you just sit there and you're not Doing anything, and you just stay the way you are, the way you don't like yourself. Then, I mean, I'm sorry to tell you, but there's like nothing you can really do for yourself other than if you actually walk in and get something done, you know. And then I, I had to learn that the hard way with a lot of people, you know, that didn't like me in the beginning, right? A lot of my friends, a lot of my friends I have now are people that used to very much dislike me. Um, and the reason they only became my friends is because. Obviously, I at first in the beginning they kind of realized, oh, he's kind of annoying, right? But I had to change myself up, you know. I I wasn't always the, I wasn't always great, and I still don't think I'm that great. Um, I don't think I'll ever think I'm great. But the thing is, you just have to get closer to the point where you want to be, and just keep trying to achieve a certain level that you haven't reached before, if you get what I mean. So some real talk today. I hope. I kind of related to a lot of you there because you see like you guys probably watch my videos think I th think myself oh wow I, I think I look so good all the time you know I do a lot of the times when I when I have a nice pump you know when I'm in good lighting and stuff like that frick I feel on top of the world especially when I'm leaned out hell yeah but uh, most of the time where you know after I eat <laughs> A huge meal and I'm bloated and I look at myself in the bathroom lighting and I look like some guy that beats his wife you know 
nah, I don't know, that's not the greatest look in my opinion, you know what I mean? So, yeah, I mean, there's always going to be aspects in your life that you're going to hate and which you're going to love. But you got to just go one step closer to having an overall well-rounded way and look at life and at yourself. You know what I mean? All right, let's shake this freaking pre and drink this freaking pre. God damn it. All right, let's see how fast this chug is. Come on, tornado method. Hey, that was pretty fast. Uh, all right. Yeah, we started this video off really real, but now it's about to be a goofy gym time. Let's flip and drive, damn it. Wake your ass up, cause it's time to go beast mode. Alright, my babies. Uh, so we're doing the second set, second to last set of Incline Smith Machine, right? Uh, we're doing 245 for 7. Um, it felt good for the first set. Let's uh, now do this set. First set we did working set and then partials. We're gonna do the same for the second set and then a nice drop set. That's the only difference, the drop set. Let's flip and go. Oh. Oh. <clears throat> No, no, no. Ah! Right now. Up. 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 One more. All right, drop set. Let's see if we go. Remember, help me on the post. Oh! Good six. Oh! 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 God! Allah Akbar. for some inclined uh, press machine. In Smith, press Smith, Riz, Riz, Skibby Riz, Skibby Riz, you know. <sighs> All right, happy bees. Um, second workout is the inclined machine press, right? Um, we're doing 315, uh, going for the six to, six to eight rep range. Last set, we got eight, which is good. Um, but I'm not gonna lie, I'm still terrified for the second and last set. Um, so, like I said, I didn't. I don't know if I said it actually, but we're doing two sets for this, right? There's the second and last set, and the first set we did the working set and then um, partials. The second set we're gonna do the working set and partials as well, but do a drop set at the end. So let's flip and go. Was that 
we're doing some um, flipping my chest cable flies, guys. After that, we're doing some more chest cable flies, but hey, don't look at my lawn. Okay, uh, we're doing mid chest cable. I mean, yeah, mid chest cable flies right now. We did the first set, and the second set. First set, we did the working set, and then after that, we did the partials. Um, and then second set, now we're doing the same thing, but then the drop set. So let's flip and go. Yeah. Beep. All right. Um, same logic as my test cable flies. You know, the working set partials. What? What? I thought the cameraman told me something. I'm just tripping. Oh my god, I forgot how sweet the cameraman is. <laughs> I'm joking, guys. This is Rob set. <laughs> First, we come become a Spider Man. Ah. Okay, let's go. <clears throat> Fucking L6. Oh. All right, guys. It's time to check that flipping pump. No, no, no. All right, Habibi, this pump's gonna be pretty flipping awesome. Let's take off the damn pump cover. Oh wow, uh, my my left ch chest is cramped. My left pec, I mean, my chest. Oh, damn, look at my arm though. We didn't even hit arms. Funny, funny. That is obviously a very good sign. <laughs> All right, let's take this off. I'm in a hurry right now, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, God. I gotta take this off so the hat doesn't come off, and then we'll check the pump without the hat. Oh, God, I missed the freaking machine to line the clothes on, but, all right. Whew, let's look at that, dude. Holy moly. Mm. Look at that pump, dude. That is 
freaking crazy. All right, other side. Oh, Damn, my freaking voice wasn't coming out and then let it out all at once. I did. That is freaking crazy. My arm is looking absolutely diabolical right now. I don't know why I look so big. All right, now one of these. Oh yeah, look at that. Ooh. Other side. Oh yeah, dude, look at that. This is epic. Mmm. Oof. Oh yeah. Let's get one of these. Oh. And then the freaking back press thing. Oh yeah. I'm probably gonna hit shoulders tomorrow. If anything, maybe the day after tomorrow. Dude, look at that, dude. All right, let's just get the hat off. Put the mic on the beard. Let's see how the pup looks without the hat. Because I'm telling you, believe it or not, I think the hat is the real pump cover. I don't know, just when you take off the hat, it makes my head look much more proportional. Ah. Look the hair, dude. Honestly, it doesn't look too bad right now, the hair. Okay. Let's do a side chest. Oh, yeah. Oof. That is looking freaking crazy. The upper chest is growing, my guy. Holy moly. Ooh, God, Lee, God. Now this is freaking skibbity. I'm sorry, guys. I'm glad no one in the freaking gym is there here to hear that. Look at that. It's freaking crazy. Get one of these. One of these two. The upper chest on this looks insane. Now... Look at that, dude. Just, just freaking, just there. That's just meat, right? Like I said, I'm in a hurry. Let's get going. This pump was absolutely flipping epic. It's flipping cinnamon, guys. Get her. Get her. Just had Sahur. She uh she's gonna be back to making biscuits on the on the the bed. And um before that, let's give her a kiss on the forehead. Yeah? What's up? You want you have something to say? No? She's feeling the moment. Uh, maybe she's just agreeing with me about the biscuits. Um, but yeah, um, let's give her a kiss on the forehead and end this flipping video. I gotta go to bed. I gotta class at 9 a.m. tomorrow. I gotta wake up at 8.05 a.m.